Hey guys, and welcome back to the campaign. We're on episode 8 of the Spanish Empire campaign. And we've been attacked again. I seem to be signed each episode on the bloody battle. <laughs> Which I hope you guys enjoy. Um, if you don't, then... Yeah. <laughs> Well, what else can I do? They're just not showing the battles, which is incredibly boring, which we're never doing. Uh, <laughs> I noticed there's no actual weight symbol. I'm, no, it's because they're attacking me. Uh, I'm so used to not seeing it because they keep attacking me lately. Um, but yeah. Uh, they seem to be... Let's hope we don't take that bloody hill. Alright. Go over here. Actually, it's a bit far away. Go there. And the whole panic hanging at the back. This should hope to be my last battle against bloody Chile. Because, not Chile, fucking the Plata. After a while, these names sort of just go in, fuzz into one after a while. Uh -huh. Yeah, I know. Yes, I know. Alright, it's two units. Two useless units. Okay. I said useless is a pretty good to be honest. They're better than what I have. And so I can't recruit any other cavalry for like ages. Target them, please. We're sure of the cans, they're quite cool. I love them. Yeah, we got a lot of our models, and this probably will be mentioned somewhere on another channel. Um, for those who don't know, most of our models came from the Rides of the Eagle sub mod, which is a which is probably models that we're getting probably for all um, all of Lucian because uh, they basically it's a 1819. I've, I did a mod preview in the install garden, there, which probably hasn't been uploaded yet. But it's alright, I mean, it's been in development for a while and it's not done great, but uh, it's not bad because it's taking a fucking long time to fire, aren't you? Come on, hurry up. <laughs> Good God. How slow are you in the middle of a battlefield and yet we're going to sit here and not do anything? I can't even show the cannons because it's just taking too fucking long. <laughs> we're going to be here all day just <laughs> contemplating life. Um, and this is not going to be entertaining. Um, again, uh, let's go here. Charge at the side. And that way, as much as I love to show the cans, they just take too bloody long to fire. Fire! And they completely missed. No, no, they didn't actually. They actually hit their army. Perfect. Let's <laughs> try and hope they don't kill all my troops. Because <laughs> that's the problem with doing these cavalry charges, that they can hit you. But because you're moving fast. There's a less chance of you getting hit. Alright, attack. They are, we are facing them, sort of, so... God, this is going to be a messy charge, isn't it? What the fuck happened there? <laughs> Fucking... Okay, they routed. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Actually, go after them. Now oh, come on, how come they routed so easily, but you didn't? Battle is in our favor. If we remain true and wholehearted, victory will be ours. Can't charge the anymore. Are badly oh, God. They have lost what are you ever. doing? Oh my God, why are you walking? <laughs> Fucking hell. Alright, aid the general. <laughs> it's not any more if I lose general troops, because, um... No, oh, for God's sake, what charge is this? <laughs> Fucking hell. They're so bad at charging. It'd be very I mean, I guess it, it makes it more law friendly, I guess, if that's the law friendly. Enemy flees the battle. But, um. Run down those worthless the Lord above his kind. So, I mean, captured the enemy's general. That will teach the cowardly dog to run. Now he can rest at our leisure. Job, that. And that way we'll charge them down like they were here once more. And I watch um, as my men demolish them and then again we all because they're better infantry than us, we are losing a lot of troops, just my concern. Here come the cavalry from that hill. Stop <laughs> firing. Right. Stop firing. Attack! Charge! <laughs> the enemy are badly blooded. 
Don't bloody... Who the hell shot that? What in the fuck are you doing? Idiots. Right, in you go. Yep, they're gone. Run down those worthless peasants. That's them gone. I don't know why the bloody hell they shot. I think it's because I had them on order to shoot, but they. Yeah, if I. Nah, whatever. That's our general dead. Now they're gonna bloody escape. Come on, don't let them escape. No, they're gone. Nice. Is that them dead? Just about. What was that on me there? I don't see another unit somewhere. Where? Oh, there's one dude. <laughs> I don't hear last very long. <laughs> One dumbass is just legging it. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Where the hell do you think you're going, you little shit? <laughs> I love the way my army just charges a massive cluster and just attack. Which I probably should just use my uh, cavalry, really. There you go. Right, victory. Thanks to my cavalry. I, I'd be screwed if I didn't have any cavalry. Oh my god. I'd be so utterly screwed. Oh, bollocks. Scout there, please. Oh. Alright, let's escape. Nothing to what the- <laughs> It's so pointless, bloody stupid- <laughs> fucking... What's the point of that? You retreat like, a few meters away from them, and yet you're still in fucking fight. <laughs> Goodness sake. <laughs> to suck at this, aren't they? Oh well. <laughs> Alright. If I do, I'll show you a trick, actually. I haven't even started the fucking battle yet, and the guy's like, We must, we must, we must fall back! We, we must fall back! Oh, what do you mean I can't redraw, you stupid fucking utter stupid game? Well, you see, you could redraw, but um, we're not going to let you. Why? Because you're already redrawed in the campaign. This is a fucking battle map. I can redraw if I fucking damn well tell my men to. Why in the all that is holy can you not retreat? Okay, fine. <laughs> We're gonna have to do this. Oh, I can't even get on that bloody hill to fight. Okay, how in the hell <laughs> can we do this? Alright. I accept your challenge. I'm bloody tired of the time they get there, but it doesn't matter. Actually, if you're on that hill just there. I kind of want them just to be just by the fullback line. Come on, guys, get there and just hold. I could put them in skirmish mode and they just run around the enemy. Our army is well, obviously, the turret haven't done anything yet. <laughs> Alright, I'll sit there and get better. <laughs> just chill for a bit. Oh, God. <laughs> Fuck me. There is no hope. Oh my fuck. <laughs> There's no hope here. Run away. <laughs> Run away! Shoot, you fucking moron. Okay, this is why it's skirmish mode. Really? Already? Fucking hell, that was terrible. Okay. Oh, I know what I should have done. I should have done it before I clicked the retreat button. I didn't realise. It's very stupid, that. Why have you gone that way? Really? Uh, 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 okay. Stupid game. <laughs> stupid fucking games on those. Uh, okay, right. Let's even get peace with... Uh, Oh, for God's sake, I need to move my diplomat again. <laughs> I know it's cheating, but I don't care. I could not care less. Um, this is just silly. I wanna, if I wanna move my damn diplomat around, we are moving my diplomat around. <laughs> it's so much bloody simple 
than having to go right this way in a whole other turn, which is another turn that I'm going to be fighting them for. Which. Oh, fuck, I didn't even click on the tile. <laughs> Yeah. Might be okay. <laughs> okay, so I want to give him Santiago, and I'm quite happy to give him the Fault Lines because it's honestly so useful. We give him Santiago, and see if we can give them. Yeah, we. Would... We suspect you will waste our time. You had best not. Right, give you Santiago. Some you not in the... Okay, they won't even fucking accept that. Really. What if I gave you the Fulton Lines? Is it San Jose? No, it isn't San. I cannot fucking remember. I ha I'm t <laughs> I can't remember. <laughs> no, <laughs> this is bad. All right now, I've got to now look at the bloody. I don't know. Whatever. Fuck it. We're fighting out. Uh, what was it called? It's called bloody San Carlos. Okay, everyone's called bloody San, and I'm not sure what the fuck is what. <laughs> it's really annoying. If I do that, my can's gonna die. But. And again, and again, if I wait any longer, it's another turn they'll be attacking me. So, I think I'll be assassin. Oh, they do. Yeah, that's interesting. Can you fuck off? Can you go away and leave me alone? Can you just leave the battlefield, please? Just get out of here. I don't want to fight you. Thank you. Alright. I have no idea where the bloody hell this summon is. It's over here. Some there, yeah, there, there you go. That's quite a big garrison there, okay. They yeah, obviously were expecting me. What have we got down here? Decent army, decent army. Okay, let's fight this now. Because uh, if I don't... I did build... Um... Yeah, I did. If I don't do it now, then they're going to come and get me and then I'm going to regret it. <laughs> I'm going to completely regret the damn thing. Now, my little plan is to shoot the balls out of the count. And then go in because I don't want to attack the walls. The battle seems to be swinging in our favor. From such tidings does victory emerge. I oh, know. All right, let's go. Oh, sort of an um, area where the towers are less likely to hit you. Well, where they actually no, the towers only fire if you're if there's an army nearby. So let's move over here. Put you there, and the rest of the military can go right here. Actually, put you in. I've got a size of an army. <laughs> Who's fucking with that? <laughs> Let's put those on there. That'll take it out a lot faster. Actually, to your point, they're probably going to mess it up if I do that. Let's hope for it. Are we firing? No, I didn't think we were firing. But yeah, we took out that. Okay, that was quick. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, what happened there? Okay, what happened? What the fuck happened there? I don't know what the hell was going on there then. But all right, my game just had a stroke, apparently. So I'm not too sure what happened. I don't know if the game was at the crash or what. Well, I don't know. I'll tell you what, don't bother fighting them. Uh, just fire at the cavalry. They're my main concern, to be honest. I can just run them out with the, uh... With them. <laughs> Let's move them in. Just immediately take control of the walls. What happened there? Our soldiers have proved their worth today. The enemy's walls belong to us that, now. That cannon crew should be fucked. Um, by the time we get in there. Tell you what, get you up here. The battle is in our favor. If we remain true and wholehearted, victory will be ours. I need. Doesn't really need that many units in it. Are they dead yet? Yep, they're dead. Which will be them gone forever. All right, get you in there. You should get in soon, then you start firing at the troops. Move fire. Give them hell, gentlemen. Give them hell. 
Well, given still is probably a bit of... Fuck me, here they come. <laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting them to leave that fucking quickly. Holy shit. Into the fray. Okay. If they're doing that, then I'm going to take their city. Because they just literally just left the place undefended. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> Let's uh, sup a line here. Put the can at the back. And... And let's put a bunch of lines in. And if I'm fighting with this cavalry... Shit. No, they're not going back to defend the sea. You think they might? It could, I could lose all my generals here. The battle is in our favour. If we remain true and wholehearted, victory will be ours. We can shoot them in the back. That would be perfect. Shoot them in the back. The enemy king raised the there you go. Fifty is ours. We lost a bit. One cannon crew, I think. I don't know what happened there. Well, that's them dead. Burnt to the ground. And then now we've sent a message to them. Tell them to fuck off. No, that's really bad. Okay. I'll keep the cannon. That'd be helpful, actually. His, it, I don't really use cannons that often in Total War, I must admit. But, um. Really? That's really... Oh, God. How bloody bad is this? God's sake. <laughs> I bloody hate public orders. It's just been the one... This whole campaign lately has just been me going, fuck public order. <laughs> I hate it so much. I could probably do the exact same, because it's the same town as that. I probably don't need to really need to bother with siege equipment. I'll take our next turn. That should be the end of Chile. Hopefully. This will be a big... We've had to starve this settlement out, because that's... What I'm more concerned about. Uh, yeah, Chile just wouldn't accept bollocks. So, we go to San Diego and prepare for battle. Because uh, it will be a long bloody war, I'm afraid, against them. And uh, we're going to speak to Uruguay and give them out more territory. I could give them some territory to Portugal. But I can't do that because I'm still bloody allied with damn fucking... Um, Chile, which I need to kill Chile, and I can go ally myself with um, Mapuche and Portugal, which would mean I have two giant allies, which is good. It's just, it's just Britain, and that is what I'm really damn. Okay, there's troops in my territory. I'm gonna assume this is provocation to attack me, so fuck it. We're gonna attack them. I'm gonna save just in case uh, something ba terribly bad happens. But we have to fight them now, or we, or we risk. Complete and utter defeat, yes. and yes. that I will not do. Now, because my fleet lost a bunch of shit because of that stupid fleet that shouldn't even exist. I mean, it would have made more sense for that to be a British ship, not a um, not a, whatever the hell, not a Grand Columbian ship. What if it still says uh, in the faction? Yeah, they do. <laughs> what? <laughs> why is it? I don't know why it does this. Is it meant to like um? Because, yeah, they're not even, I don't know, <laughs> my brain just can't cope, I don't yes, think. Uh, we move down, attack their settlements as we go. Their fleet is certainly going for me, and uh, we need to be careful. I hope these armies sort of bugger off. I do have a decent force up here that I can probably defend with and attack them if need be. I'd rather not, but, uh, you know, actually to be honest, um, we'll just move it out. Get out of that. Oh, for God's sake. Ah, public order. Fuck off. Really? Just leave me alone. How many fucking units is it going to get? Okay, I'm going to... Okay. <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <I> <laughs> ah. <laughs> How many units does one require <laughs> to keep the settlement stable? Oh, that's terrible, isn't it? God, public was 60%. Oh, look, I'm in 206,000 debt. <laughs> this is something like we're definitely nerfing in the versions. It's the, we're putting a limit on the debt, as I mentioned before, because um, it's just ridiculous. There's no way you're getting out of that. Um, there are some campaigns I played. Um, it was, I think it's the Bolton series. No, it's the Greystock series. 
And we recruited a massive army to the point where I was complete debt. There was no way I was getting out of that for these 200 or so turns. But yeah, and uh, obviously the playtesting, he wants me to go on to turn uh, 60 something. Which means I don't know if I'm even going to get to turn 60, to be honest. Because once I kill Britain, France, or maybe the Dutch. Actually, no, the Dutch are still alive. No, they're... Yeah. <laughs> um, probably once we finish with Chile, we'll probably go and help against the Argentinians. Or not help again, but kill them. That's what I mean. Uh, that's all. Yeah, okay. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's skip ahead. Okay, guys. Um, right, let's begin where we left off. So I'm moving Captain Sancho from the other summon, utterly useless, <laughs> to take this fort, which will take us two turns to get that. And probably three turns so we actually take the thing. You're also laid in siege with Lope Demonagues. I'm sorry if I screw some Spanish names up. I do apologize. Actually, funny enough, I do actually have family in El Salvador, which is I'll face them. <laughs> which is interesting. Uh, some of these have got really bad public order, and I cannot be bothered. As long as it doesn't do a civil revolt and goes back to bloody Chile, then I think we'd be okay. Now, in the stupid move with the AI, they've put their fucking I think all their generals and then the most of the decent generals, uh, pres uh, vice president, into a bloody fort. Which I can now lay siege to and <laughs> starve them out and <laughs> kill them all. So, yeah, yeah, I didn't really see that one, did I? <laughs> but anyway, now uh, we have moved up. I managed to get a general, uh, Roy May, so he's joined us, and he's now we're now besieging the uh, Guyana city, which was originally ours. Uh, got Tostig Tostig at arms, which is a bit of a bit of an old name. And Thomas is Normandy. And then we're also leading siege to this army, which we're going to do a battle of this now. Uh, I'll explain why, because this fleet is about to come kill me. And this fleet doesn't have enough movement points to sort of flee somewhere. <laughs> because I need to take this now, or this we're going to be screwed. And uh, no, haven't got the best troops. Most of our troops are better than those, actually, which is good. Alright, let's go slaughter some British. Okay, let's do this. So, we're going to send the baton around and take down all these walls, which they're not defending. And we got a cavalry in here. If it were, what's the formation even called? It was like the, it's a column formation asset, right? Uh, from what I can see, they have. They don't seem to be going towards this town, don't they? Unless uh, no, they're all going. They're going to sit in the town, which is probably what they should do. No, uh, because there's not much else they can do, to be honest. In theory, there shouldn't be a problem with taking that. Because they're not defending those towers. Right. Let's hold here then. And then we'll move our infantry in later. It's probably like they just not really charge in. Oh, <laughs> another way how fast they take those walls down. Perfect. Alright. It seems a bit of a odd for me. Okay, so it's like a pathway in there. There's a pathway in there. Okay, that makes sense. Um, now how do I want to do this? Because I can move my cavalry in and then lure them out. But they've got some light lances, which arguably aren't as good as my staff cavalry. And I've got farm militia as well, but no. So, yeah, because they'll probably immediately charge. So it's probably good just to send them all in. Actually, I don't know why I put them there. Because... They have to go any around anyway. <laughs> so, a bit of a silly decision by me. So, I think it's probably best if I. I don't know. Hmm. Let me think a minute. In some really weird attempt, my gunners are shooting over the houses. How the fuck does that work? I was wondering why my camera getting shot at because for some fucking reason they're like it's really bloody odd. I don't know why it's happening. <laughs> How could he shoot over a bloody? Oh Christ! All right, All right, charge in. All right, in that case, then put you in the line in the formation. Just go at the cavalry with your swords. If you have swords, please use them. I'm going to watch my cavalry come in the center and break their farm militia. Right. 
battle is in our favor. If we remain true and only half. Where the before... bloody hell are you doing? No, the fuck, they're gonna die. Praise the saints. Our men have taken control of the city. My lord. Yeah. We have lost control of the city. Right, this went to a bloodbath very quickly, doesn't it? Fucking hell. The whole thing oh, fucked up when um, they could bloody well shoot over the fucking over a house. How the hell does that work, game? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Alright, apparently, apparently some mystical power <laughs> allows them to shoot above me. Thankfully, this actually public order shouldn't be too bad because we're all the same culture. Thank the gods. <laughs> I'm getting bloody well sick of... Um, Alright, let's get down there. It's a good thing about attacking Britain because your public order won't be terrible. God, this is terrible as well. <laughs> Fucking hell, it's... Are you, is, is the priest doing anything to help? Or is he just, just sitting there doing nothing? <laughs> Fucking hell. Now, can we do any battles here? I'm honestly thinking it's probably best just to sit there and wait. So we end the turn and go from there. Oh, bollocks. Mm, oh, no. Oh, fuck. I wish I could do a naval battle and just flee. Why can't I? Why does that a thing? I guess... I shouldn't even lose this because... Let's be honest. My fleet got fucked by that Colombian fleet that shouldn't even been there. So... Yeah. Yeah, I don't... I don't yeah, I don't think that's really fair. To be honest, and... Um, yeah, I'm not... We're going to be fucked. If we, let's, let's be real here. If I lose this fleet, we are screwed. We have the army in there. That we're screwed. <laughs> we're, we're screwed. <laughs> so there's no other way I can do this apart from going all to win Defender. Because we're fucked. <laughs> It'd be alright if I could just build up some uh, more ships. and That'd be alright. But, um... But see, look. <laughs> what the fuck am I going to do? <laughs> I'm going to auto win it all the time because I'm just dead. They don't, and the auto win thing doesn't even uh, sink ships. So, yeah. Do you want me to win this campaign or do you want me to die boring? Which is what's going to happen. Oh god, fuck me, look how many British army to send up. Jesus. What do the Dutch want? No, I'm quite happy with the Dutch because they're not exactly bad. Reduce one. Oh, fuck me, I have loads of guys over in Lima. I completely forgot about you guys. I have completely forgot. Uh, you, you, and you. So let's immediately send you guys south. Because more cavalry about, right? Actually, it's probably a better idea to go through here on that way. Or is it? I don't know. Just go through there. That's pretty bad. I need to go down that. You besiege Cordoba. And um, my diplomat can stay there. Where's my army gone? I had over here. I'm trying to have rebelled. Oh, for, for fuck's sake! Uh, why? Why? Why did you do this to me, game? Yeah. So I didn't, I didn't even notice that. Uh, Rials is actually the currency, which is quite nice. <laughs> which is what, um, which is maybe the currency in Assassin's Creed Black Flag as well. God damn it, that army rebelled. Ah, uh, that's really annoying. Yes, my because... Uh, fuck! <laughs> God's sake! Alright, don't click on anything. I need to have a look at the garrisons. Mm. France is down there. Do I attack France? I'm thinking not. Yes. Plotting course now. Alright. Let's besiege George Town. I must admit, my army's not looking great. But, uh... I don't have a lot of choice. <laughs> I'm sorry about doing that with all winning the, the shits, but let's be honest. If those shits are dead, and this army is dead, the campaign for me up north is over. And you'll literally watch Britain just rape the entire northern continent of South America that I control. Because and it will not be fun to watch everything I've done come undone. <laughs> it will not be good at all. And uh, that's, well, that is why I am I did have to all win that. Because it, it comes down to... I'm playtesting. I certainly... I'm, I'm on the schedule, right? I'm on the damn schedule. I have to get this done by Friday. Or or at least... Well, no, I'm not doing it Saturday. But I have to get it done by Friday. And it's currently 4 o'clock. And I usually stop recording in like 2 hours. Because I go have dinner and watch a film. 
So, <laughs> I'll get as much done as I can today. Um, so I don't have to do any more, less I have to do tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> that is, I do apologise again that this campaign will be not as long as it would would be. I mean, for 2.0, I'm going to do a really long campaign as Portugal. Uh, Brazil, sorry. Uh, see, I, I want to do Brazil, but I may even want to go do Portugal. I could very much change my mind. Uh, with the Mapuche faction, which will be split into three factions. I'm just conquer the southern part of America. Southern part of South America. And then with uh, Brazil, I'm going to conquer a lot more. And I'll leave most of that to... Um, I will leave most of that to... Uh, to um to your own to um in the, uh, I will leave most of it ambiguous is what I was trying to say <laughs> or feign to say um but yeah Brazil will be a long campaign Spain really because it's playtesting and because there's a few I mean there's a few major bugs and one bug really and it's I, it's not really a bug but I guess in a way it sort of is it's just a bad mechanic that we're gonna work sort out it is this debt problem that uh, is really shooting myself in the foot <laughs> which is why I can't really keep the campaign going very long because we're um yeah <laughs> what I will do and what I will do when I take out Chile and I take out um bloody La Plata and probably Britain and up here which would be the main campaign the last of the campaign will be focused up here taking out Britain and mainly maybe go after France or the Dutch or well, the Dutch is already dead um, the French are left and an ally with Britain, so they're probably a threat to me. And uh, once we've done that, we will skip ahead to whatever turn your boy wants me to do. Uh, I have to go check, but it was like turn 60, I believe. We we'll go back and uh, we we'll go. No, I mean, not go back. We we'll go forward in time to the point where I've secured all my rebel settlements and everything, and go from there. Now I won't go into the rainforest. Uh, main reason being because it's. Uh, hell to go in there and I'm wa waiting for 2.0 so I want to leave that leave the invasion of the rainforest for later on uh, till uh, my Brazilian campaign which could either be Brazil or Portugal it's very it is very much uh, yeah, I don't know <laughs> really Portugal's alright oh, we will have a look we'll go toggle foe once we get to turn 60 and have a look and here comes the sun from my window and I can't see anything okay uh, we're in this episode off here. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I do know it's slightly, um, <laughs> slightly been a pain in the ass with all the rebelling settlements and all that. But, uh, you know, <laughs> it is this campaign, and I will say, this campaign is not full of faint hearted. It's not easy. It's not meant to be easy. So if you see me swearing and getting annoyed, you will be scared and annoyed as well. Maybe some of you won't be as annoyed as I will be because, you know, maybe you're a bit more relaxed than I am. But, um, yeah, <laughs> if you want to play in Spain, especially in 1.0 or 2.0, maybe mainly 1.0, but don't worry, the debt problem will be fixed, so you have more chance of getting out of debt. But uh, you will suffer. <laughs> you will suffer badly. Anyway, guys, hope you guys have enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you later.